What's up guys, my name's Noah, I don't have a fancy YouTube name yet, um, gotta come up with some ideas for that. Uh, lately I have been addicted to Minecraft. I know I'm a little late to the game, but uh, anyways, the past five days I have built myself, I'm not sure how many rooms, but I have made many, 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 many hidden rooms in my house. So, so here we are at my house. I spawned somewhere around here. I don't even know. Can I look at what seed this is? Uh, I don't even know. I'm still trying to figure out. Eh. Oh well. Oh, hello little wolfie. Anyways. Alright, so if we walk up to my house. This is my door. Eh. Now, I have a... I believe this is 20 levers? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14... 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20 lever combination lock. Now, I had a sign over there that said Fibonacci, so if anyone knows the Fibonacci sequence, well, they can get in my house. So I'm going to go ahead and put that in. 1, 1, 3, 5, 7, no, 1, 1, 3, 5, 8. 1, 1, 2, 3, 5, 8. Wow, I can do math. Anyways, you put in the correct combination, and the door slides open into my little yard. Got a nice garden over here. Uh, if I didn't want anyone... Well, that's nice. Hmm. Sorry about that. Waiting forever. Hey, well, now we're back. That took a long time. So, as I was saying, if I didn't want anybody to enter into here, or, well, I mean, if I was trying to get people to stop following, go ahead, hit this lever, make a bridge, and this lever here connects to the same circuits as the rest of those levers. Flip the lever. Coming into my house, I got a dog, I got two dogs, oh there he is, the other one's just sticking his head in a box. Now, I really don't care about the, the fact that there's a fire, this should have already been down. Got a small, small ass room. Here is something important, remember this number, one, two, three, five, seven, four. Five, three, two, one, seven, and a f oddly phrase, odd phrase. Frame this key in your memory. That's a little odd, but okay. Come here. There's a pressure plate on the floor. Pulls down this trap door. Hit the lever. Opens the fireplace. And again. I've made it accessible so you can just close it behind you if you want. Comes into a nice little room here that actually has nothing special about it. So, move downstairs. Got a nice little, I like to consider it a war room just because. Why not? Anyways. We have buttons all over the floor. Now, some people might think, oh, you have to hit the buttons in a certain combination. However, it's actually a puzzle. We're going to go to the armory first. Uh, weapons plus armor here. If you notice, the three is, uh, takes the place of the E, and the L is capital. So if we actually go to the third button on the left... There's a lever behind that. Opens up into my armory. 
I got lapis, I got gold, and I got diamond, and I got redstone. However, I do not have iron, surprisingly enough. I'm gonna go ahead and eat some stuff. Not that that'll do much. Oof. Come over here, we got the uh, room that guards the prison. Also, again, E took, uh, is replaced by a 3, and the R is capitalized. So, third button on the right, hit it. Oop, missed it. There's a lever there, pulls the seat back. Sure enough, we got a prison. Now this is bedrock, so nobody can get in, or nobody can get out, I'm sorry. If we come to the end of this hallway, you see a river of lava flowing down, and there's doors at the end. Oh, so far. However, I have spaced this perfectly, so I, if I were to try to run and jump, I would not make that jump. So if someone were to not really pay much attention... They wouldn't notice this lever back here that pulls the staircase out over top of the lava. Now, again, I made my lever accessible from the other side if I wanted to close it, but I'm just going to leave, uh, for the sake of time, I'm just going to move on ahead. Um, here, I guess I didn't show it. Here, utilizes um, the beacon, not beacon, uh, laser doors, yeah, beacon door. Um, you can't, yeah, it is a beacon. Um, now, if this were above ground, uh, it would look like the laser door that I, I think I got, got it off of uh, Mr. Crayfish's site. Shout out to him, he, he's helped with a lot of my creations. Anyways, since it's underground, I like to consider it a force field, since it just doesn't let you go through. So, this one, I, this is my favorite door here. I made this look like the art gallery that it is. However, beacons can actually be used to send redstone charges. Um, so, I take this beacon here, just click in here, sends a redstone pulse through, and opens this door. Closing it behind me, but I take this out, this one's very nice and simple, this takes literally two minutes to make. Take out the water, slides open, fill it back up. Now, uh, when you create this you want to make sure you have a space next to uh, next to the block that the ladder is on so you can put a ladder on both sides this way you can come up right next to this and the bench that's up there needs to be a staircase upside down so you can reach this corner moving on we have the library now there is, again, another secret room. If we toss any item, it doesn't have to be a book, I just like to use a book just because it's a library. So, toss the book on top and it opens it. However, this is one door that you cannot shut behind you. Sadly. Now there's, this utilizes the, uh, secret room behind the painting. This is here just as a, just to fuck with people. If people come up to the painting, they're going to press buttons thinking, oh, maybe they can figure out a way to get the next room open. However, the next room is not through the painting. It's actually through here. Toss an item into that bench, it drops into a dropper that drops into a chest and opens the door. So if we take that item back out, the door shuts behind us. 
here's my one one break room coming on to the bank vault now I left this open just for the hell of it it's a but this is what it would look like if it were a stranger and let's say we have the wrong combination in and we press a button that is my dog moose say hi moose alright put in the correct combination this opens now this has trip wires through it that actually if someone were to break into the vault without getting the right combination and they went across this tripwire, that same alarm would go off. Again, hidden room behind the painting. Now this is a combination door, key, pin pad, key, whatever you want to call it. My password is uh, 27381 and the door over here opens. close it behind you now this is a working elevator that um, when going up in these elevators I have to jump sometimes because sometimes it'll just have me fall right through the bottom but uh, I try coming on down If anybody likes what they see, I can give them links for uh, every YouTuber that I had ideas off of. And I can give you the uh, how to make the 20 lever combination lock as well, since that is one that I have done by myself. Probably should do a tutorial video, that'd be nice. I've learned a lot about redstone over the past five days. Coming here we have the uh, pressure plate door. If you hit the wrong pressure plate the door shuts and then you have to restart. So I'm going to go across 425 And I have an escalator. You step on this. And look at that. All I'm doing is pushing forward. I'm not even jumping. Um, we got another one of Mr. Crayfish's nice uh, things here. We got um, the password locked door. Now I am running out of video time here so I'm going to quickly go through I got what is greater than God more than evil than the devil the poor have this the rich don't if you eat it you die anyone who likes riddles will know the answer immediately but we'll take a piece of paper and just put the answer to the riddle first off let's just drop a regular piece of paper in just to show that the door does not open. We'll rename it. We'll drop it in there and the door opens. Hit this twice. Oops. Once to close the door, another to get the item out. And now one of my favorite rooms. This is the most dangerous one here. Um, so since I'm in survival mode, I got to be careful and focus. Ah! ah! Well, I didn't focus careful hard enough. Anyways, moving on, we have the nice uh, redstone uh, in an item frame, the item frame and lock combination. So I'm just going to put my combination in here. We got uh, one, two, 
three. Oh, I moved all these by one. Five, seven, five, three, two, one, seven. The door opens. Now here's another uh, elevator that this is the one that you have to jump in or you fall through the floor like that. So I made a set fail safe. When in doubt, make stairs. <laughs> Climbing up to the top. On to my next room. Using an airlocked room. Beautiful design. Nicely made. Hit this button in the corner. And if you stand here, you'll uh, be able to catch your breath. Moving on. Hit this button here. And the water level will go down and the door shuts. And there are redstone comparators underneath that act as a timer. So once all the water is gone, the door opens. And this is my master bedroom. And that is that. If anyone wants to know how I made any of this stuff, I will make a video or uh, contact them to contact you directly. Uh, that's that.